bunch of dogs playing poker. This one's great, but guess what? This week we had a three-way tie between a guy named Mandra, we got Dave Hardy, my old buddy, and then Mr. Cook, Mr. Cook Draw. Yeah. So we gotta figure out how I'm gonna pick which one of these guys was the winner. And I don't know how I'm gonna do it, so let's figure it out. I'll see you in a second. All right, I got three stickies on the board, and I'm gonna throw something at him, and whatever sticky I hit is the one I'm gonna do. Let's go! And the winner is Mr. Cookart, who has asked me to draw Captain America in ancient medieval armor. Let's do it! All right, so I have Googled Googles. ancient Asian. European vaginas. <laughs> Just Nailed it! Queen Elizabeth the first. Queen Elizabeth, it's giant, giant vaginas. I'm trying to find a great set of armor for Mr. Rogers to wear. Howdy, neighbor. Define ancient. Well, because like AD was. Well, that's what I'm doing. Belonging to the very distant past or no longer in existence. Oh my god, you should draw him. Synonyms. Early, prehistoric, primeval, primordial, primitive. What about the knights who say knee? What about that, put them in that outfit? Knights. Knights who say knee. Who okay. say knee. And that is what he's wearing. Deer! Mustache. Deer! My, my eraser that I no, threw. No, you threw it at me, that means it's mine now. Well, then so I'm gonna loan it to you. Give, give it to me on loan. I'm yeah, gonna put it on layaway. Oh, you owe me money. You owe me like a nickel. Snickle. I've already given you all my quarters for laundry, so that's what you get. Today we even got diamond encrusted wedding bands. Yeah, I know. I have a few of them on my hand right now. That's right. That's right, ladies. Diamond encrusted for the wife. It's got it's got it's crusty, crusty ass diamonds. It is crusted. This is a crusty ass ring I got from my crusty ass wife. Hey <laughs> You're sleeping. I hope you find this couch comfortable. I'm not sleeping on that couch. You You're sleeping on the crusty ass. You don't want to sleep with me? That's that. great. You sleep on the couch. That cannot, bed's comfortable. I cannot accept this. You. I, I don't like it. It makes me sad. What makes you sad? Crustiness? Take a shower once. Oh, you. He's like, look, I know I don't have anything special here, but I want to be a famous. And I figure the best way to do it is by being on Antiques Kim Roadshow. Like That's how Kim Kardashian got her start. Without Antiques Roadshow, we'd have no keeping up with the Kardashians. I think you're Damn it, Ryan Seacrest! I think you're getting Kardashians mixed up with, or uh, Antiques Roadshow mixed up with video. Right, I, I do confuse those a lot. Wait. What? Oh. <laughs> oh. Once again, we come back to Bob's fart challenge. Fart farting challenge, where he will attempt to continue to be married to the same woman after farting continuously every day for the last 12 years. Now you you don't fart. As far as I can tell. Well, I do. It's just I don't make a production out of it. <laughs> I do make a production out of it. I don't shush the room and then proceed to make noises. I do. I do. It's it's like it's like uh, it's like I'm gonna come in. You guys, everybody, be quiet. Everybody, be quiet. Shut up. I have something really important to tell you. The president died. No. <laughs> Devil, but they're like the only way you can think to to really express that love is through bedazzling your bedazzling jacket. Bedazzling your weird jacket. 
it, it was it was completely original when I found it. When I found it, but I didn't like it, so I completely. It was an original draft of um, Macbeth from this fella named Shakespeare. Now I didn't think it was very good, so I wrote in some different parts. So I just you know. I wrote in a few pieces. Um, I, there's a, there's now a, a character named Randy, and what he does is he goes he goes to dinner and farts. <laughs> And I thought it really spiced up the play. So, if you want to take this priceless relic and melt it down for the pure silver, you certainly could do it. Uh, I would rec recommend against it. It's a thousand dollars worth of silver, but it's seventy-five million dollars at auction. Right, but um, but that'll give me tickets to the Bama game, right? Thousand. I mean, I just look for a quick buck here. You can't trust grandmas. It's the grandmas you have to be most afraid of. It's always the grandmas. You never see them coming. You, exactly, which is why it's brilliant. If I was going to run an international drug ring, the first thing I'd do grandmas. is enlist every grandma in the tri-state yeah. area. All right. Internet. Now, internet, it's time. Internet. We're gonna we're gonna start giving you a quick glimpse into the American medical system. Now, your old pal Bob had his gallbladder removed last week, and our uh, we just got our information from our uh, insurance company as to uh, what exactly uh, the charges were for everything that they that they did to me. Now, um, it's a fairly routine procedure. They they go in and they uh, cut out your gallbladder and then they sew you back out. The procedure cost, in toto, $29,000. That's just the surgery, that's not even like- That's just the surgery. Anesthetic. That's not the anesthetic. That's not my stay in the hospital, but that's not that. $29,000, okay? To, so, so that I would no longer have a, quote, chronically inflamed gallbladder with polyps. Um, now the good news is, is your old pal Bob only has to pay a thousand five hundred of that, but we still we the think official bill has not come. the official bill hasn't come. Don't be surprised if I'm suddenly begging you for money because <laughs> that's pretty scary. Uh, suddenly seeing those numbers popping up like that. Wait, 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 wait. So on, on an Antiques Road show, they have mannequins that have glory holes in them? Yeah. Hey, man. You got your Back in the 1960s, Art Deco silhouette mannequins. Art Deco glory hole mannequins. Glory hole mannequins. $2,000. That's a lot to, you know. It's a lot of money to pay to stick your into something. Yeah. I did an ancient knight in medieval armor. It's actually a knight who says me from the very famous Monty Python and the Holy Grail. You can tell it's Steve Rogers because he's got the big Captain America. Captain America face, very heroic. Big A, bunch of garbage in his head. Really tall. All America, all the way, even though it was a British comedy. I did it! Woo! How did I do? What should I draw next? You let me know in those comments. I'll see you next week. Bye bye, buddies! <laughs>